Hello everyone, Tom from everystepcalculus.com, everystepphysics.com. I'm going to show you how to turn your titanium calculator into a difference, difference quotient solver. And um, one of the most uh, hard things in Calculus 1, most useless uh, also, it's an exercise in, uh, they call it the definition of a derivative. Um, so anyways, let's do it. Index 8 to get to my menu. I'm going to scroll down here to get to difference quotient. The D section. There it is there. Very good. Here's what you're doing. You're, you're putting x and delta x, x plus delta x, in place of every x in the main function. Um, now, generally, we put h, x plus h. But you do whatever your professor puts on the blackboard, OK? But remember that. I say that here to remind you. And we have square root of functions or um, a regular function. And we're going to put the problem in right now. And we have to press alpha before you enter anything in these empty lines. So we're going to go to alpha x cubed minus 7. And we'll show you what you've entered. You can change it if you want. I say it's OK. And we're doing this. We put x plus h in for all the x's in the main function. So here it is in here right now. You're going to have to work it out as a cube. In other words, you put parentheses around this now. I have to do it with quotation marks. That's what the calculator gives me. Uh, and so we're going to have to do the cube exponent there. And when you expand it, here's what you get right here. You write this exactly in your paper. And these plus and minus signs exactly. And we simplify. We get this right here. And over h. We factor out the h. Here's the h here. We divide those out. And we get this right here. And at h equals 0, turns out to be 3x squared plus 0 plus 0, which is 3x squared. Pretty neat, huh? Everystepcalculus.com. Go to my site and turn your calculator into that difference quotient solver if you want. Have a good one.